channel. Today's video is going to be making my own face masks using this kit I got from Michaels. Let's get into it. So this is what the kit look, kit look like. It's from this Make Market Company. They also had like a crochet scarf one and like a jewelry one. But I didn't get this. So I'll give like a close like this and I can make a... I can't find it. I could make like a rose one, some like vanilla or something, and then like a, I don't, I don't know. Whatever, we're just gonna make. It. So I'm gonna open this box in time lock. Okay, so when I um out, is there instructions or something? In here? There is. Ah, oh, there's a problem. Out, so I'm gonna get my little instruction. Oh, these aren't the instructions. They're like the stickers that I can. Put on to my face masks. They didn't give me any instructions, so I'm kind of don't know what I'm doing. It's fine. Maybe there's like instructions on the back or something. Not that I'm seeing. Like they have like a little. Like that kind of shows me what I'm doing, but like I don't know. This is terrible. They need to give me instructions. Ah, just kidding, guys. I found the instructions. Y'all probably saw that the whole time, but I'm a little... Okay. If there's, like, coconut oil or stuff I needed to get with this, I'm going to be so salty because they didn't tell me and I don't have that stuff. Okay. Well. Make your own face mask with the do-it-yourself face mask. This kit includes blah, 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 blah. Okay, it does. Here are the steps to create your own nourishing face mask. Add a few scoops of the clay of your choosing into one of the mask-based containers and mix thoroughly to combine. Is this what? Oh, okay, okay. Choose an essential oil to add. I'm guessing those are those two things. Okay. Stir, blah, blah. Combine one or more clays into the base. Okay, place the lid back on your container and add the label. Okay, I don't see, oh, they, there is actually an applicator safe. So it looks like this kit is actually good once I found the um, instructions, cause I'm a little, I literally can't open this. Like, One of these out. Just gonna open it. It's like a cream. Ugh, smells really bad. Then I'm gonna take the clay that I want, which I want to use rose. Looks like this. It's oh, one's gonna. It's like a little tiny. Oh, you all can't see. It's like a little tiny jar of clay. Fine. And I said to just add a little bit. I feel like I added way too much, but it's fine. So I grab my little mixing wooden stick thing. I'm just supposed to like mix the clay into this like creamy base thing. Okay, so I've mixed it all up. And it's like this light pink color. Then it tells me to add a couple drops of um, whatever essential oil I choose. Kind of confused because they're both lavender. So, what difference is it going to make? Like, is this choose an essential oil? Sis, they're all the same flavor. A couple. Of. Add a few drops. Here we go, kids. One, let's go. Jesus. Sorry, this is taking forever. Whatever. Okay, so I mixed in like the essential oil so that I can combine one or more clays. This one is volcanic mask, clay mask, and this other one is like 
French green. So sad, I don't know. I can't even get these out of here. What is a volcanic mask? I don't know. Let me use this French green. Because... Nah, that'll ruin the pink color. I'm gonna take over this white volcanic clay. Then the mask should be good, and I'll use the little masky thing, put a sticker on it, and try it out. Then I'll make the other ones just in like time lapse, and I'm not gonna try it. No one wants to watch me stir 20 times. I stirred, so I'm just gonna put like whatever's left on the spoon on my face really quick so I can put the cover on it, you know. And I'm gonna add a sticker, and then I'll be back. Okay, so I put on this sticker. Oh. Sorry guys, I'm sorry. So that's what it looks like. It's kind of like cute. It's like I low-key kind of like it. Anyway, I'm gonna get the little tool and so this is what they give me to like apply the mask. So I'm gonna just do that. And like while I'm editing it, I'll probably like speed up because no one wants to see that. I just don't want to change the time lapse. So I'm just gonna scoop a little. I don't know how well this is gonna work, honestly. And they didn't tell me to like clean my face before, so. Girl, I'm literally gonna use like all this mask to do my face once. That's terrible. Like this wasn't expensive. And it was, I think it was like 7 47 Ew, I just remembered that. This is a clay mask. So I don't know how long I'm supposed to leave this on for, so. not drying too quickly which I kind of like because sometimes I'm like trying to spread out and it's already dried like right as I put it down but I do like it to dry a little on the quicker side I don't know how long I'm supposed to have this on my face for so I'm gonna read that clearly I didn't mix it very well because it's like that on the bottom but who cares? We'll do better next time. So I'm supposed to let it sit for 10 minutes or until dry. So I'm going to let it sit for 10, 10 minutes. And if it's not dry by then, then not honestly. And I wasn't picking my nose, like, right here. I got face mask in my nose, and it's like making my nose itch. So I'm gonna make the rest of them in time lapse, and then I'll be back like after that until the 10 minutes are up. Okay, so it's been 15 minutes since I put this on. It's just really not drying. I mean, it's it's pretty dry. So I'm going to take it off. I 
read like the thing it said I could add rose water or like regular water so I added water into this one and it was like a huge mess so I don't like explain that see I don't mix it too on the bottom but this one's like a grayish green color this one is a light green this is the one I have on my face I hate that it makes like so tiny but I'm gonna keep like all the supplies I'm going to leave them on my little desk here because, what? No. So I've got another ton of lavender, so kind of like that. We're going to go upstairs and, you're being extremely lazy, I'm going to wash it off in my kitchen sink. Well, this is definitely not the way to do it, but... Oh. It's still hot. You guys forget this. We can't do it. It's like in my eyes, so I'm using my emergency face mask. Remover. I'll use like a baby wipe to get it off my skin right away. Cause sometimes I have like really bad allergic reactions to some face masks. I need it. I just yeah. Okay. So that making those masks was took kind of a long time, but my skin feels like really hydrated. That was really close, but. This is a great angle. My house is disgusting, but well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. People are unsubscribing, and it's kind of really annoying. Like, I got to 162, and now I'm back down to 159, and like, they're like, I'm sorry if I miss like a Wednesday or Friday, like when I was supposed to post or whatever days, Monday and Friday. But like, I'm just a really busy person, and sometimes I just can't make it there. Like, all this week, I've had cheer. And I, and it was like choreography week, so I couldn't, like, film a video there. And like, I didn't have time to. And I, yesterday's practice went to 9 p.m. Today's was at 7.30 a.m. Like, I'm not about that lifestyle, so, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And go subscribe! Ew, this is like pom poms for my mom's work. G N C! G N C! Go Green Mountain! I don't actually cheer like this. I'm a competitive cheerleader. But. Ew, stop. I'm gonna stop it like the pom poms right on my face. No, I have to wave.